we're under the helmet with Chiefs linebacker Andy Studebaker. You've been around for a little bit to kind of appreciate this Chiefs and Raiders rivalry. It's Raider Week. Do you have a grasp on that? One of the coolest experiences was last year at the Raider game here. We opened up and you can just tell that the city has a buzz about this, about this rivalry. And if you read the history and the things that have gone on in that rivalry, it's a lot of fun to read about. I think we know what's at stake here. And obviously it's a big division opponent for us. And also just another step along the way for us as the season goes on. So I think we're, I think we're grasping it. This defense at the beginning of the season, I don't want to say that you guys weren't respected, but most people were talking about the Chiefs offense. And you guys have come together and, and put together a pretty good start. Yeah, I think, I think we're making progress and we've been like we said uh, from day one here, since OTA started is, if everybody gets better at something every single day as a collective unit, we're all gonna get a lot better as the season goes on. And we've been doing that ever since day one, getting a little better and just working on the little things and having 11 guys doing their job, knowing what they're doing, communicating. And because of that, you see a lot of different guys having success. And I think that's why we're seeing a good bit of success so far. A game like last week's, it's so up and down, uh, it goes down to the final play of the fifth quarter to be decided. Are you guys kind of on, on the edge of your seat on the sideline like the fans are going through those emotions or does everything just happen so fast you just roll with the punches? That was one of those games where the ball kept bouncing back and forth. It was in their favor, it was in our favor, it was in theirs and ours. And as a player, you just have to kind of keep grinding, keep grinding and when the opportunity comes, try to capitalize on it with a big turnover or a stop that takes them out of field goal range, something like that. We're just one play at a time. We forget about the last one, look at the next one, don't think about the one that's coming. I mean, if we do that, we're going to give ourselves a good chance to win. Is that one you think you might remember back years from now? It seems like in past years, that might not have been a game that a Chiefs team won. You guys showed a lot of grit in, in sticking with that. Yeah, I mean, obviously in the last couple of years, we've struggled to close those games out. When you can win those games, I think it's a sign of progress. Being able to finish the game off in that fashion kind of shows that we're getting better. And uh, just got to keep doing that. Uh, Doc, I just got your email. I'm out for the season. Oh, don't worry about that. I switched to Sprint's $69.99 plan, so I get unlimited emails. What, what does that mean? It means I'm dropping you for my fantasy team, that's for sure. What does that mean about my knee? Oh, your knee's totally shattered. Did you see how hard that guy hit you? I, I don't want to see... Hey, 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 relax. Not costing me any extra. Only Sprint gives you unlimited text, web, and calling to any mobile for just $69.99. Sprint, the Now Network.